about the size of the solar system. Today we're going to use a model to talk about the size of the planets relative to the sun and also the distance of each planet to the sun. In our model, this we are using a model that is one ten billionth of the actual scale. Uh, what that means is, if you think about the sun, this balloon that is 14 centimeters in diameter is one ten billionth of the size of the actual sun. So go with us on with this journey to each of the planets to see their size relative to this sun and just how far they are from the sun. So we're going to start here at the city market in downtown Lynchburg and then walk all the way to Pluto. Let's attach the sun. There's a mustard seed. It's a teeny tiny thing. Hold it out of your hand. Hold still. That right Hold still. there. All right, so our second planet was? Venus. All right, let's head to our third planet. Here's a mustard seed. Oh, oh, five. Here's five a mustard Earth. seed. Yeah. Here you go. All you right. So what? our third planet was what? Earth. Earth. All right. Let's head to the fourth planet. <laughs> solar system. We 
We just traveled 65 meters from our last planet. No we can't difference. even see the sun in our, in our particular model, way back here at the market. Now we're at the barber shop. So our next planet, Mercury, Venus, Earth, Mars, Jupiter, we're at Saturn. And show them, show them Saturn as a piece of cereal. Hold it out. Saturn would be the size of a piece of cereal. Awesome. Compared to a balloon. Compared to the balloon. All right, let's head to our seventh planet. Yay! Jupiter and Saturn. So we still walked a really long way, as you saw back there from the from the sun. some pepper flakes? Yeah. All right, so Pluto is teeny tiny compared to the sun. This has been an awesome journey through the solar system. I hope that you see just how far our planets were from the sun, especially the last four that are gas giants, and just how little our planets are compared to our sun. 